Hi there guys, welcome back to the channel. We've got a short video here for you today just to demonstrate how to play a piece of music automatically on your Wix website when it first loads. So if you'd like to create uh, some atmosphere for your site and have some background music when it first appears on someone's device, then this is how you'd go about it. So you'd need to add an element is the first thing you'll do. And on this website, I've just used a little template just to demonstrate for you today um, and have a think about what area you'd like your music player to appear. In order for that music to start playing automatically, we're going to have to do, throw, do so through the use of a player. And then you can access them by hitting the Add Element button in the top left. Navigate into the Video and Music section. And you can see here that it's got a bunch of different audio players for you. So the example I'm going to use today is the Wix music player. However, you can do the same with the SoundCloud players, the Spotify, the iTunes buttons. They all work in a very similar fashion. So if we use the Wix music player, and I'll take this um, full version here. You've obviously got the little compacted version as well. And I'm going to single left click and drag that onto my website. So once I drop it in place, it should appear like this. And obviously you can edit it. Once you left click it once, you'll notice that there's a settings tab here now above it. So if you click that settings, this is where you'd navigate to obviously the settings of the player. But before you do that, it brings up this prompt. So as opposed to going through that process and being able to sell your own music, for now, I just want to design the player. So hit that little text option below the button there. And here you get the settings for the music player. Obviously, you can add music to it and you can manage your pre-existing library of music. There's a number of ways that you can bring audio into Wix, which we won't cover in this video. That will be in another one. However, it's very self-explanatory. So obviously, if you hit the Add New Music button, it takes you back to the area of your dashboard where your music exists and you can add it from there. So for, once you have established what music you want it to play, whether it be a link to another site or your own, under this little settings box here, this is the area here. So the auto play section is what you want to turn on. So if you click that button on, it's obviously going to start playing whatever music you've loaded into that player as soon as the page appears. Okay. And as you can see, it isn't available on mobile and some internet browsers. Okay. So it's deactivated on mobile devices and internet browsers. Um, that's just not something you can work around in Wix. I would recommend giving good access to the user for this little player, because if they want to turn it down, turn it off, or skip back, they will obviously want to know where and how to do that. So don't hide it away. Make it somewhere obvious for that user to see. Okay, and that concludes our tutorial to today, for today. So there's a link in the description for this video for those of you who want professional level one-on-one -on -one tutoring in Wix, whether that be support for beginners or how to rebuild sections of your site for pre-existing users. And like I said, there's a link to that in the description for this video. If you like the video and you'd like to see more content of this nature, give us a like and a subscribe. And if there's anything that in specific you'd like to see, any requests or any questions, obviously drop that in the comments down below as well. Thank you very much.